Hello again, my second graders. It's part seven of language acquisition, a year in perspective. Remember, there will be eight units this year, and in each unit, there will be a different kind of performance test. This is the course theme, and these are the questions for unit seven. Let's read the course theme together. You work for the marketing department of a large tech company. Your company produces gadgets and software that help people in their daily lives. It is your job to create various kinds of media to teach consumers about your company's products so that many people will buy them. You make commercials for TV and radio. You also make posters for train stations and advertisements for newspapers. First, you will need to read about the products your company makes. Next, you will have to write various kinds of texts to promote those products. Can you write creative and informative advertisements? Let's check the theme. Who are you? You're a business person, and specifically, you work in the marketing department for a large tech company. Tech companies make things like computers, smartphones, music players, and other kinds of technology. Your job in the marketing department is to create various kinds of media, such as TV commercials and posters. What do you have to do? First, you have to read about your company's products. Then, you will have to write various kinds of texts to promote those products. Then, you will have to write various kinds of texts to promote those products. When you write your texts, they should be creative and informative. So, you will have to read about your company's products and write creative and informative advertisements. That's because you work for the marketing department and your job is to help people select your products. These are the questions. Let's write the answers together. The first question is, what are the differences between commercials and posters? Well, commercials could be on TV or on radio. Hmm. First, com oh. commercials can use various kinds of sounds and pictures. Posters can use pictures, but they cannot use sound. Second, you must read a post. So, the most important information should be easy to find. The next question, should we use the same information on different mediums? For example, commercials and posters. So if I make a poster, should I have the exact same information? Why or why not? Hmm. I think the same in I don't think the same information should be used in different mediums. That's because the kinds of people who will see each medium is different. For example, Adults will read in the newspaper, but 
younger people will watch commercials on TV. Okay, so I think that we should use different information because each medium will have a different audience. That's why my answer is this way. And finally, with question number three, it says, how will we decide how will we decide what information to put on which medium? Okay. When we decide the information to use, we should think about... And then that's how I'll write my answer for question number three. So please add your question three to Manabox in your discussion group, and we'll check it.